Good day! Kumusta kayo, future researchers? Welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is me again, Teacher Tin May. And for today's vlog, gusto ko lang na bigyan kayo ng short introduction about the topics that we are going to discuss for quarter 2 in research. Pero bago tayo magpatuloy, gusto ko lamang batiin lahat ng students all over the world, especially here in the Philippines, at lalong-lalo na sa aking mga grade 7 students, grade 8 students of STE program, Science, Technology, and Engineering program, at syempre ang mga SPFL, Science 8 na sergente ko. Nag, uh, binabati ko kayo ng isang malaking, malaking, malaking congratulations because you've completed quarter 1 of this school year 2020 to 2021. So I know that this is a big challenge to all of us because we are still here in pandemic, but of course, napakahusay nyo kasi nalampasan nyo ang first stage of this school year. I know this is very hard for us and we are still struggling. But of course, we learn how to adopt and we know how to survive. So congratulations sa lahat. Siyempre, congratulations sa inyong lahat at sa lahat ng mga isadyante na nag-aaral dyan at nagsusumikap na maunawaan ang lesson. Maraming maraming salamat sa inyo at talagang na-appreciate namin and I would like to recognize and appreciate the effort that, that you've exerted to finish this course. So, kung bago ka pa lamang sa channel na ito, syempre, huwag mo na kalimutang mag-subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell for more updates in Research One. So, again, kagaya nga ng sinabi ko, so this vlog, we will discuss about the different topics. Okay, that you will encounter for quarter 2 in Research 1. So, ano po ba ang mga pag-aaralan natin na topics para sa quarter 2 na ito? So, panoorin hanggang dulo. For quarter 2 of Research 1, for the content standard, the learner should demonstrate understanding of the integrated science process skills such as describing relationships of variables in research, developing scientific questions, formulating hypotheses which are needed in planning an experiment. The learner should be able to design a simple science experiment using the identified variables on a researchable problem. So what are the topics that will be discussed for quarter 2 in Research 1, particularly for grade 7 students of science, technology, and in engineering program students? We have 7 weeks for this quarter 2, week 1, week 2, until week 7, and our week 8 is intended for the complete completion and accomplishment of the assessments, projects, and other learning tasks. Okay, for week one, it's all about defining variables. And for the learning competency is to identify variables in a given problem. For week two, it is all about identifying variables particularly the dependent variable, independent variable, and extraneous variable. So the learners will distinguish variables depending on their uses in planning a simple science experiment. For week 3, it's all about the formulating scientific questions. And we're going to discuss about the characteristics and sources of a good scientific question. The learner should develop a research problem and question. For week 4, it's all about formulating hypothesis and you're going to differentiate about null hypothesis and alternative hypotheses. And for alternative hypothesis, you're going to determine whether it is a non-directional alternative hypothesis or directional alternative hypothesis. And the learner should formulate a hypothesis. For week 5, 
It's all about describing the relationships between variables, linear relationships, unrelated relationships, and nonlinear relationships. For the linear relationships, you'll be able to understand the difference between a positive and a negative linear relationships. The students or the learners should explain the relationship between variables, of course. And for week 7, it's all about designing the experiment and differentiating experimental from control group. And the learner should design a simple science experiment. Okay, and for week 8, of course, this will be the completion of all the activities, assessments, and other learning tasks for quarter 2. Ayan, so kung gusto nyo mag-advanced study, so ito lang yung mga topics na i-discuss natin for this quarter. So pwede-pwede ka nang mag-advanced study at panoodin mo ang mga advanced videos na i-upload ko sa channel na ito about research one. Siyempre, tungkol yan sa mga variables, identifying variables, and different relationship among variables. So kung ikaw ay grade 7 students under science, technology, and engineering program, Huwag mo nang kalimutang mag-hit ng notification bell, subscribe button, and like button para updated ka sa mga upload nating video about Research One. Again, binabati ko ang aking mga sudyente from STE Asteroids, Comets, and Constellations. So, congratulations sa inyong lahat. Napakahusay. Tumutok lang sa aking YouTube channel. Dali upload natin ang mga advanced lessons natin sa Research One para sa quarter 2. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Again, this is Teacher Din May, your research teacher, hanggang matapos ang school year na to. Thank you. <laughs>